from question 42 get all deployments stateful sets and daemon sets in your cluster with maximum listable information but it should be without headers also place it in a file called all deploy dsstsinfo.x. info dot x so let's just first check how to list everything quickly and then i will tell you why this question is important for us g get deploy and then ds for daemon sets sts for all the stateful sets and then you can say hyphen a for all namespaces hyphen o wide for all maximum possible listable information that we can fetch and hyphen no headers would be for headers we are avoiding the headers which detail about this particular object that we are listing all the objects that we are listing and let's just run it you can see this information here is properly listable all because the fonts are bigger so you are not able to see a proper formatting here but otherwise it's properly listable now we will just place it inside all deployed dsts info text and this is it this was part of the question but why this is important is let me tell you that so in in a given question you might find a container name is given or a port name is given but because the number of objects within cluster is too high so it might be difficult for you to identify exactly where my object belongs to whatever the pod or container you are given is it a deployment is it a daemon set or is it a stateful set replica set so you can only get the information properly when you know this is the command g get deploy ds sts so this is very important because it will help you when you need to deal with larger number of objects in a cluster so that's it for this question see you guys